Alright everyone, well in this video I'll be taking a look at the changes that have happened in Ubuntu 14.10, so at the moment we're on the beta 1 release. So at first glance, what is the difference there? Nothing. It still looks pretty much like Ubuntu 14.04 does. Sure we've got an uplifted kernel, so they're using kernel 3.16 now. And some of the changes in that are we've got improvements on all the graphics cards there, so across all the range of manufacturers, AMD, Nvidia and Intel. Got some improvements on the B-Tree file system and XFS file systems. Nothing though on the extension 4, but uh, since that worked pretty well, not that worried really. And for owners of Dell Latitude laptops, the freefall sensors are now working. So that is the sensor that can detect when the laptop is being dropped, and it suspends the hard drive to try and prevent damage to the system. So, all those are improvements in the latest kernel. But as for software that we're seeing there on the screen, no, not a lot. But it's not to say nothing's happened, because uh, I was a bit confused really, looking around on the internet and I come across the blueprints for Utopic Unicorn, this release of Ubuntu 14.10, and the blueprint says only 35 results, which is weird, because if I look back at blueprints for Ubuntu 14.04, got 117 results, and for 13.10 got 195 results. So what is the change this time? And the answer is, we now have an Ubuntu Desktop Next. So this is Unity 8 running with the Mir display drivers. You can now download the ISO of that and install it on your system. I've been a bit rushed this evening trying to get it all going because most of the day I've been working on that lot behind me which is fitting out uh, shelves into a cupboard above the stairs. If I try and run Unity Next, I can get to the light DM login screen, pop my password in and nothing happens. And that's the end of it, I can't get any further than that. I've tried changing the settings on 3D acceleration here in VirtualBox, I've tried setting auto login, nothing makes a difference though. Now in the ideal world I would go and do a full system install, probably won't even work with it because of the NVIDIA drivers. But as I said, I've been busy today, so we'll take a little bit of a look at Unity 7 on Ubuntu 14.10. So you can see that the Linux kernel has been uplifted to 3.16, and we are running Ubuntu Utopic Unicorn. The version of GNOME is still the same here, GNOME 3.10, although weirdly the derivative Ubuntu GNOME is running 3.12. Totem has been uplifted to 3.10.1. LibreOffice has been uplifted to version 4.3.1. Firefox has been uplifted, and that is it. Unity still seems very responsive. If you make a typo, you can still find the applications. I've turned off the online searches for the security and privacy settings. That's it. I'm not going to say anything more with this distro, it's pretty much what Ubuntu 14.04 looks like. But thanks for watching, I'll see you all later.